Hello, everybody, and welcome to Meet the Dog. I'm your friendly local kennel assistant, Chris, and with me today is Miss Tasha. So Tasha is part of our triple litter, born back in March, so her birthday is actually coming up soon. Isn't that right, sweetie? Her parents are Sir Richard and Bianca. She eats twice a day, three cups each, our standard meal plan. Um, she probably weighs, I want to say, around 80 or 90 by now, I would say. We'll, pro we'll probably we'll be weighing them soon for uh, all worm or so. Going forward, I should have the actual weights for everyone. Uh, let's see. Training-wise, I hear she's actually doing very well in pretty much everything. Uh, just, I hear, I saw in the notes a little bit of confidence issues. Um, and then occasional, just occasional things like sniffing people, once again, the confidence, um, uh, poor recall every once in a while, but I see a lot of good things on the training sheet. Um, so Tasha, you can recognize pretty easily by the, as you can see, she's got her Braveheart or Phantom of the Opera mask, depending on, uh, what, what you, uh, depending on your reference of choice, I like to go for the Braveheart face paint, but I've also heard the Phantom of the Opera mask. Uh, she loves playing with, uh, all of her friends. She gets along pretty well, pretty well with, uh, just about everyone. I think the only dog I've had trouble with her was Jack. Uh, she didn't seem too interested in playing with him, though I might try that again at some point. To see if that has changed at all. Um, right now she is in Kennel 9. She is next to her brother Riker. And uh, as well as Fred. Um, who is over in Kennel 8. Let's see. Some fun things about Tasha. Uh, she keeps stealing rags from us whenever we're cleaning in here. That's something I keep having to yell at her for. <laughs> I'll put a towel down uh, so I'll, I can dry the floors later and she'll try to steal it from me. Um, let's see, what other fun stories have we had? I believe she's gone on a couple overnights now and I heard some good things from that. She's a very good girl. What else do we have? Um... She can get a little mouthy and a little jumpy sometimes. It's something we're working on with her. Um, it's not too bad. Nothing aggressive. Nothing Nothing I would be too worried about. But sometimes she gets excited, tries to play with people, and will jump a little or uh, try to nip at them a little bit to get their attention. No, nothing too serious, but obviously we'll be working on that with her. Um, what else? Oh. <laughs> Uh, yes, well, I think it was yesterday or Monday, she, um, she actually, she hasn't jumped on me in a while, but the other day she tried to jump on me and she did it from behind, so I kind of waved my arm behind me to correct her, to obviously tell her off, you know, he can't jump on me, and I ended up accidentally grabbing her paw, and she <laughs> ended up tripping and landing face first. She was fine. But I think it taught her not to do that again. <laughs> so I think she hopefully has learned her lesson and she won't be trying that again anytime soon. Isn't that right, huh? Uh, what else? She's a good girl, yeah. She's doing very well right now. Are you tired, huh? Did you have a long day of playing? Let's see. Anything else that I can think of that would usually be asked? That's all the time. Oh, everything I can think of. Uh, sorry again that we're doing a pre-recording and not live so people can ask questions. Once again, the arena, there's still being work done in there. And right now, Bianca is in the puppy room. Uh, so I won't have to move her around. Uh, so hopefully next week I can steal one of those rooms and we can do a, a live session for another dog. Uh, but yeah, so thank you all for tuning in. And we'll be back next week with another dog.